everyone. We're back here at Kit Fox to talk about a few of our options. Specifically, we're going to talk about the lighting options that we have available for the Kit Fox today. We choose aero LEDs for a reason. Part of that is they proudly fly the American flag. They're made right here in Boise, Idaho. So a U.S. manufactured product and the founder of aero LEDs is actually a Kit Fox owner as well. So we're proud to offer their product line and are happy with, with the overall aesthetics, the performance, and after all, why do we choose lights? Well, we choose lights so we can be seen. Specifically, during the day, more than at night, the, you know, a, a light is going to be bright at night in the dark. During the day, with the sunlight that's, that's out there, we want the brightest light available. We feel the Aero LEDs offers that brightness. They stand out very well during the day, um, whether it be the navigation, uh, landing taxi lights, the wigwag features, um, all the things that they have available for them. I can tell you a little story about a night flight that we, we did uh, here a few years back as we went into the downwind at the Caldwell Airport here in the local area. We had somebody come on the radio asking what airplane was landing over at Caldwell because the lights were so bright they thought it was a bigger airplane. And we told them it was a Kit Fox. They said, well, you're lighting the sky up like a 737. So it was really kind of exciting to hear that, especially a testimonial from, you know, uh, unsolicited from an airport that was seven miles away. They were in the final approach for uh, uh, Nampa Airport. So that was kind of a nice little uh, um, kudos to Aero LEDs for the brightness of their lights. On that note, I'd like to talk about a little a few of the options we have available for the Kit Fox. Specifically, when you get your kit, it come, the wing kit comes with a wing tip. That wing tip is a, just a standard wing tip. No provisions for lights, for nav strobes, or for the landing lights or anything like that. The upgraded tip has provisions specifically for the nav strobes and also for the landing taxi light. It's designed specifically for the Micro Sun, uh, uh, which is an aero LED product that we have here on the end of the table. It has a nice lens that goes over the front of it. So it's a, a well-designed tip, and that's the wing tip upgrade, the landing light uh, upgrade. This is the Micro Sun light. It's a three light, nicely done, well-designed light. Does, it, it works really well in the upgraded tip. Next to that here, we have the Sun Tail. Uh, the Sun Tail is a, somewhat of a new offering that we have. We've designed um, a housing for it that is designed to go on the uh, airfoil tail or the Speedster tail. It can be put on prior to cover or after cover, um, even after paint, if that's the case. You just have to pay attention not to get the glue everywhere. The Sun Tail is, a, is not only a, position, a tail position light, white light, it is also a strobe light, so you're getting the strobe effect on the tail. It's well done. The nav navigation strobe lights for the wing tips, on the provision that's on the outside of that tip that I showed you, has the green red light for the uh, position lights, and then the white tail light for the rear light. Now remember, the, when they're on the wing tip, they're 32 feet apart. So somebody coming directly up behind you may not pick up those white lights on the tip, especially on the STI where they have fences on the ends and the white light will be blocked so they need to be offset one way or the other. That's where the tail strobe really comes into effect because it's directly on the tail, it'll stand out well. While not required by the regulations to have this, you're required to have a white rear position light for night flight and this satisfies that need regulatory wise this will actually make you more visible in the air and it's a fine option to have out there. It makes, in fact, our STI, when we're out flying with the STI, you'll almost always pick up that tail light before you'll pick up the, the actual strobe lights, especially when you're coming up from behind it. So that's the Pulsar lights. Um, again, well-designed, well-engineered light. They, they also have an aesthetic appeal to the aero LEDs, which is really nice. They pay a lot of attention to the aesthetic qualities. A new addition that we've just offered is for the STI. We now have a light provision for that, that this gets bonded into the tip. It has a nice acrylic lens for it, and it is specifically designed around the sunbeam, which six row lights, super bright lights. I'm excited about seeing this on the, uh, at night. I've only seen it during the day, and it is pretty darn impressive when you watch it come into land. So uh, that kind of covers the the light packages that we have and the options for the Kit Fox today. I appreciate you taking the time to watch the video. Enjoy, get out and go fly.